Hey everyone, it's Anna from the For Real YouTube channel. Are you struggling with a blocked IMEI or bad ESN on your phone? Don't worry, I've got you covered. In this video, I'll show you multiple ways to remove a blacklisted IMEI from any Apple or Android device, including Samsung and others. Before you consider those sketchy services or software, let me share a better, safer, and free alternative that's quicker and guaranteed to work. Let's dive in. Remember, this information is only for responsible use. It's for people who own their devices but have forgotten their access info. We do not support or encourage illegal actions like bypassing security on stolen devices. Respect the law and others' rights. Our video follows YouTube's guidelines and community standards. With that out of the way, let's continue. Before we dive into the details, let's quickly talk about some services you might have come across. There are a lot of options out there, but not all of them are reliable or safe. It's important to avoid those sketchy services and instead focus on ones that are trustworthy. One of the best options is Unlock Here's AI-powered unlocking web app. It's the most up-to-date, fastest, and best of all, it's free. Another great service is Safe Unlocks, known for its long history of reliable service and it only costs a dollar. Then there's ESN Doctor, which specializes specifically in IMEI blacklist removal. Now let's get into how you can use these services, starting with Unlock Here's AI Unlocking Assistant. Go to your browser on your phone or computer and navigate to unlockhere.com to access the website for removing the blacklist on your IMEI. You'll be greeted with Nifty, the AI-powered tool developed by the Unlock Here team. Scroll down a bit and choose the Fix IMEI Blacklist option. Follow the steps on the app, starting by selecting the brand of your device. All major and medium-sized brands are compatible. Next, enter your IMEI or serial number. You can find your IMEI by dialing star hashtag 06 hashtag, which will display a pop-up with your IMEI number. Provide a point of contact, including your name and email address, and make sure to comply with all the terms and conditions of the app. If you have any questions, check the resources available. Once your request is processed, you'll receive an email with your unlock details, usually within 5 to 15 minutes, so be sure to check your spam or promotion folder if needed. To confirm and activate your order, copy your verification code, click Confirm IMEI Unlock, paste the code, complete the CAPTCHA, and press Validate Info and Start Unlock. And that's it. Nifty, the AI-powered tool, does the heavy lifting from here. The final step is to simply insert a compatible SIM card and restart your device. This process is just a few steps, and before you know it, you'll have successfully removed the blacklist IMEI from your device using unlockhere.com. If you encounter any issues, live support is available. Note that these unlock services only work in first world countries. If you can't access the services or prefer not to use them, we offer 250 unlocks weekly for our video viewers. To enter, like this video, subscribe, and comment your device model, your IMEI, and your country. You will be automatically entered once these steps are completed. All right, guys, here are some more alternative ways to remove an IMEI blacklist from your device. First, contact your carrier. This is often the simplest and most direct way to address a blacklist issue. Explain your situation and they may be able to help you resolve it. Next, provide proof of ownership. This can be a receipt or any document showing you are the legitimate owner of the device. Submit this to the carrier or authority that blacklisted the IMEI. If they can verify your ownership, they might remove the device from the blacklist. If your device was reported lost or stolen and you've since recovered it, inform the carrier. They may update their records and remove your device from the blacklist once they verify the recovery. Regularly check the IMEI status of your device. Sometimes blacklists are updated and devices are removed for various reasons. Use online IMEI status checkers to monitor any changes. As a last resort, consider legal action. If your device was wrongfully blacklisted and you can't resolve the issue through the carrier, consulting a legal professional may be an option. Keep in mind that this step can be costly and time-consuming, so use it only if all other options have been exhausted. These methods can help you address and potentially resolve a carrier blacklist on your device. Thanks for watching. If this worked for you, or if you have any other questions, please comment below.
Remember, the unlock services only work in first world countries. If you can't access the services or don't want to use them, we offer 250 unlocks every week for our viewers. To enter, just like this video, subscribe and comment your device model, your IMEI, and your country. You'll be automatically entered once these steps are completed. Make sure to subscribe to our channel for more helpful videos. Hit the notification bell so you don't miss any updates, and give this video a thumbs up if you found it useful. See you in the next one!